What happened to the beloved HBO series? Why didn't we get Carnival Season 3? Could the show return? Long before Game of Thrones became a money printing machine for HBO, when most TV fans were captivated by the works of Tony Soprano, there was a show that slipped between the cracks of Sunday night television programming, but not without leaving an indelible mark on its fans. Carnival's complex mythology and fascinating approach to storytelling turned it into an instant classic and a headache for HBO's marketing team. While the show proved to be an overnight sensation with a small but loyal fan base, the concern at the time was that the show wasn't as accessible as something like Sex and the City, which aired immediately before Carnival every Sunday. A considerably high production budget also meant that Carnival's relative success wasn't quite enough for the broadcaster. The show ended its run after only two seasons, even though the plan was for it to last at least six. Thousands of carnies were left heartbroken after the cancellation, clamoring to HBO for a revival. Unfortunately, this was the early 2000s, and internet campaigns didn't quite carry the weight they do today, leaving Carnival in its current truncated state. However, if there's one thing we learned when The Many Saints of Newark became a massive success for HBO Max last year, it's that there's lucrative potential in resurrecting beloved TV franchises for new audiences. The same thing is happening right now, to a lesser extent, with House of the Dragon, a show that fans have taken as a sort of remedy for the Game of Thrones' disappointing final season. Would it be unthinkable to believe that Carnival could live on for season three? As we briefly mentioned, Carnival was intended to run for six seasons. Every two seasons would be considered one book, with the entirety of the show thus being a literary trilogy. This means that only the first book of Carnival got produced. If we follow this logic, the first season of a tentative Carnival revival would be the first chapter in the show's second book. In almost every regular series, this would prove too narratively disjointed to consider. But Carnival is not an everyday show. At the center of its mythos, Carnival was always a show about good and evil, and how those forces can manifest themselves on Earth in unexpected forms. This overarching plot reached its natural conclusion by the end of the show's second season finale, but there are still many aspects of the show's mythology that aren't yet fully explored. So please, HBO, give us another chance! The mysterious world of Carnival deserves it! For more of the best entertainment content, visit fortressofsolitude.co.za.